It's my three year anniversary. Right, how do I do this? God, that was so loud. Yay. Hey, what's up everyone? Um, today is a very special day because it is the third year of me being on YouTube. If you didn't see, I have an Instagram and I actually took a poll on there and I just kind of wrote in the comments like, hey, what would you like to see me do? Do you want me to do truth and dare? Do you want me to drink pickle juice? For whatever reason that popped in my head. And it tied. So I'm gonna do a little mashup of truth and dare and pickle juice shots. So everyone knows the basic rules of truth and dare. You either pick a dare or a truth and you have to do it. Although I've never played a truth and dare where like there is a consequence to like if you don't do it. So I'm doing my own consequence. So basically if I come across a dare or a truth that I don't want to answer, I have to take a shot. Without further ado, let's get to celebrating. All right, first shot being poured. <gasps> I just spill it all over myself. Thank God I got that towel there. That would have been a disaster. We got a first one. What is your darkest secret? Well, we're already starting this off great. Cheers. Oh my. Okay. That was delicious. <clears throat> oh, that made my eyes water a little bit. Question two. Empty a glass of water on your head outside. Like a minute in. And I'm gonna pretty much drink myself to death with pickle juice. Okay, it's not so bad the second time. <sighs> my mom was right, this was a stupid idea. But it's to celebrate the three years that I've been on YouTube. Have you ever been fired? No, I have not. Lick a bar soap. Here we have a lovely box of Irish Spring. Let's hope it tastes as good as it smells. I don't know why I'm doing a Russian accent. I recently started watching Daredevil and I got to the part with the Russian, like, gang. And now I'm, like, obsessed with the accent. I'm doing this for you. Mm, I don't want to. I don't want to. Yep, that's just as bad as I remember. Oh, that, oh my god, no, it's not. It's not stopping. My mouth is gonna taste like Irish Spring for the rest of the day. Gotta love the Irish, the great lads. Do a freestyle rap. You see, I would, but do I look like I can rap? If you said no, you're absolutely correct. Like number three or something. This is just a disclaimer, please don't do this. Like, if you drink too much of this pickle juice, like, it will, like, eat your stomach or something like that. Please don't do it. What animal do you think you look like? I know exactly which animal I look like. Give me a second. Wait for it. That is, that is me as an animal. Every time you see a sloth, you think of me. Lay on the floor and act like a sizzling piece of bacon. All right. Okay, how does this work? This sizzle, 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 sizzle. I'm sizzling. Can you hear me sizzling? I'm a crispy piece of bacon. 10 out of 10 would be a sizzling piece of bacon again. What is the most unflattering school picture do you have of yourself? Ooh, middle school, here we come. I'm trying to focus it. There I am. That was me when I was in... Eighth grade, I'll take a picture and I'll try to put it up here. I'm trying to blur this kid's face out. If you couldn't tell, eighth grade was absolutely a horrible year for me. I mean, the bangs alone. I look like freaking Lord Farquaad, for God's sake. Eat a piece of dog or cat food. See, I'm starting to wonder if this decision is worth it because I'm gonna be remembered for this. <sighs> Another shot down the hatch. She is mate. Okay, it's starting to get to me a little bit. Get the worst drink at Starbucks. You gotta be kidding me. I'm back. Um, I asked several baristas what they thought the worst drink at Starbucks was. They all unanimously, they all unanimous, unanimously, unanimously, they all unanimously agreed that the kiwi starfruit or whatever is the worst, but because they didn't have it, they recommended the pistachio latte. 
I don't know about y'all, but I kind of like pistachios, so I might like this one. I don't know. We're about to find out. Is it bad that I like it? I don't know. It tastes kind of good because you get that little pistachio aftertaste. I mean, I kind of didn't like it in the first half because it just tasted like burnt coffee. But when that pistachio hits, it ain't that bad. This is quite refreshing after the pickle juice. Reveal all the details of your first kiss. Sorry, Bailey. Um, so it was my first boyfriend. Um, it was after the pet band rally for one of our basketball games. And as I was walking away, I hear someone be like, wait. And I turn around and it's my, my boyfriend, my now ex-boyfriend. And he grabs me by the shoulders and he thinks for a little bit and then he kisses me. I was not ready for this. So like to me, it was really awkward, but in all honesty, which first kiss is not awkward. But yeah, nothing exciting, but it was it was nerve wracking to me. Oh my God, the pickle juice is coming back up with a vengeance. What's the worst thing anyone has ever done to you? I have like three answers for this. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. <sighs> Damn it. I'm sorry, but I don't want to relive it. <laughs> I don't want to do that anymore. What is the biggest lie you've ever told your parents? Um, I am okay. Yeah, moving on. What is your favorite body part? This is gonna sound really strange, but I like my ears the most. I don't know why. I think it's because it's just like, I love earrings. I love wearing earrings. So it's just like, I love the piercings that I have. I want to get more. So I'm gonna have to go with my ears as my favorite body part. What do you hate most about yourself? That's a freaking loaded question. Like, I don't know. Sometimes I'll just be having a good day and then my brain is just like, wham, you remember that thing that happened a long time ago? And it's just like, my days are completely ruined for like a week or something. It's just like, I hate my brain. I hate my brain and my brain hates me. So the feeling is mutual. What are your silly nicknames? See, I want to take another shot of pickle juice because this is going to be embarrassing. So mom, this is for you. I love you, but why? Picnic, Nickel Doodle, <laughs> Nicky Doodle Bug, Nick and Knack, or Nick Knack. And there are a few others, but I can't really remember what they are. How many people have you kissed? Just one. Eat a bite of a banana peel. I don't even know if I have bananas. We have bananas. That already tastes horrible. That's nasty. Oh my god. Now I got Irish spring and banana peel in my mouth. Okay, that's my next torture. Put five different drinks into one cup and drink it. Hi, welcome to Those Summer Nights Barista. Um, today I'm gonna be making you a drink. It's gonna be fantabulous. We got some lovely peach, some mango, some water. We even got some pistachio. And we got some pickle juice. This looks like something that came out of Shrek Swamp. It smells like pistachio mixed with pickle juice and God knows what else. But down the hatch. Happy three year anniversary! I think I'm gonna throw up. Oh my God. I have tasted a lot of things. This was the nastiest thing ever. So Starbucks, if you're looking for a new barista, I'm your girl, I'm making drinks all day long. Okay, now I don't like that drink. Eat a teaspoon of mustard. You got it. I'm not doing the pickle juice. I can't, I can't anymore. Happy three year anniversary! Uh, 
I love you all. Fill your mouth with the drink and gargle the next truth. Bruh, okay, fine. Okay, here we go. Have you ever broken a law? Mm-hmm. Or have I? I'll never tell. <laughs> What's your biggest fear? Ooh, okay, that's actually a good one. Um, kind of several. Um, I fear literally, like, just running out of ideas. Like, I love being a creative person. I love to think about new things and just, like, let my mind wander. The day I run out of ideas, I think, is going to be a very, very hard day for me. Um, other than that, my biggest fear is that life is meaningless. Go outside and dance like a cowboy. It's so cold out here, so here we go. I'm a cowboy. I am absolutely frozen, so I hope that you all are happy. Let an ice cube melt in your mouth. This isn't even a cube, okay? That, that this isn't fair. Okay. I'm gonna continue to let this melt in my mouth after I read this. What is your excuse to bail on plans? Um, I try not to make excuses anymore. If I'm not feeling it, I'm not feeling it. But my old excuse was like, oh, sorry, I have a lot of homework to do. <laughs> it's so cold. My mouth is frozen now. What is the most embarrassing thing you've ever done? Oh God. I've done a lot of embarrassing stuff. I was in marching band and we actually got to go to Orlando um, in Disney World's March in the Citrus Parade or whatever. And we got to go to like all the kingdoms. We had passes to go to all the kingdoms. So we went to the Animal Kingdom. I didn't realize that there were like, um, like those bars that like you have to stand in line. You see, I got distracted by someone's dog. And as I was looking at their dog, I got crotch punched by the bar. And I literally just went, <clears throat> and I just like had to fall over it. And everyone was like, are you okay? I'm like, yeah, there's a dog over there. So like, it was embarrassing because everybody saw. There was like nine people in my group and then plus everyone else in the park and everybody saw that. So I was just like, and just went on with my day. Now that I look back at it, I kind of laugh, but I was so embarrassed by that. Eat a teaspoon of hot sauce. See, I don't think that this one's gonna be as bad because I love hot sauce. Like, I'm definitely not my mother's daughter. She cannot handle the heat. I absolutely love the heat, including hot sauce. Um, This is Louisiana style. So Louisiana, I don't know if y'all have good hot sauce, but I'm gonna find out. Okay. Oh yeah, that's good. I would not mind doing that again. That is so, the spice. Louisiana, hats off to you, babe. Go or raw egg? Would I rather get a stomach ulcer or salmonella? Ugh. Never mind. This is why I hate myself. The pickle juice mixed with the hot sauce is killing me. Remove four pieces of clothing. I'm not. No. Next week I'll post an update from the hospital. Ugh. For the love of God and everything that is holy, please do not do this at home. My head is killing me. I am sweating right now. Create a hat out of toilet paper. That I can most definitely do. Those summer nights crafts. I'm gonna be making a hat out of TP. Okay, so basically you're gonna take it like this, you're gonna wrap it around your head like a lovely bandana. You're just gonna keep wrapping it and then you're gonna you're gonna tie it. 
okay and then you're gonna like wrap it in together now you have a little bow crown plus your dance moves pickle juice lifetime embarrassment because I ain't got no dance moves you know a little little swaying action change it up just go a little slower you know do some hand action just all in the shoulders baby all in the shoulders I call that dance move I don't know how to dance to save my life parkour the heck how do I do that y'all ready for this because I don't think you are I'm gonna jump over this chair watch it parkour I'm obviously a parkour master as you saw by that lovely demonstration do a hundred squats do I look like I can do a hundred squats? I'm done. I have completed all of the truth and dare questions. I feel like death, but we aren't done yet. Here's your daily reminder, don't play with fire. Uh, my three is falling. Happy three year anniversary to the channel and to everyone who has supported me on this channel. Um, when I first started, I didn't really think that I'd be doing it for this long. I was just like, hey, you know, why not? Let's let's see where this goes. And I'm actually really, really happy that I stayed with it. I hope to continue growing and to build a community so everyone has a place where they feel safe, where they feel welcome. And I am very thankful for everyone who has subscribed to the channel, even if they just came and watched a video. Thank you so much. And happy three year anniversary. Here, want some cake? Here you go. Here's some cake to celebrate. So, thank you all so much for watching. Thank you for supporting me this far. As always, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope to see everyone in the next one. Until then, stay safe out there. Bye!